and and it's why we do it as or you know I say we as cadre, but it's why the cadre do it, right? In terms of um, punishment for all, oh. somebody messed up. Now everybody's going to pay because that that level of guilt that that person feels, or at least you should feel, right, uh, is real and it's very very heavy. You will, and and it leads to things, right? Because that that person, if they feel guilty, like they have a chance to turn it around. If they don't feel guilty, then the teammates see it, where they're like, "Oh, well, like it's not my fault." It's like, "Whoa!" Like that. Everybody in the pipeline reaches the point where they have to take responsibility for all of their actions. Like that's where we're getting to. And so, like, if you're getting smoked, and the dude that that got you all smoked is like, "Oh," like making excuses. Oh. It's gonna get real, real quick. <laughs> yeah. No, dude, we're all doing this for the fifth hour because no. of you. Yeah, <laughs> to like acknowledge that. Yeah, like it, it, it's fun to watch those moments when the cones actually like they start talking amongst themselves and then they start taking care of the problems for you. It's, oh, I uh, love that. It's, it's wonderful. Love that. Yeah. <laughs> Cadre, they just hate me. They're just out to get me. Are they? Maybe, probably not. Though we noticed <laughs> that. Also, we didn't all do what you did, and now we're all getting smoked because of what you did. And you know, like the, the, their eyes open eventually. No, I I do love it. Whatever they the the cones end up taking care of in inner problems. That's good. Good on you for for those out there that are that are in it or have done it. Like good on you. Keep that keep that up because that's what we need. Because we're going. In the team room, you're going to police each other, hopefully before the commander or the chief find out about it yep. or, or have to get involved. Like that, that kind of stuff should not reach the commander or chief if, if, um, if it can be handled at the lowest level. Yeah. Well, and, and that's what it's all like a progress thing, right? Like we, we talk about being your own cadre when you're development or even before that and holding yourself accountable. And also, that's all this is, is like self regulation turns into team regulation, turns into all these other things. And that's where that trust comes from, where the, the commander can be like, I can send a group of fairly young people into the middle of nowhere to do a really difficult thing and know that they're going to get the job done and know that they're going to do the right thing. Like that's where that, that's, that trust comes from. Like people from the outside sometimes, will, and I, I complain about it all the time, like, oh, you guys are cowboys because you don't cut your hair or, or whatever, or you wear <laughs> rugby shirts and all this other stuff <clears throat> but that's that, that's the opposite of what it is the the, the thing is is, is that the trust the self-regulation like the, the command knows that like these guys will do what is needed to be done no matter what and that starts with yourself in development that you got to regulate yourself before you can start regulating the team and that self-regulation uh isn't always pretty or it isn't always accepted by people outside the community Right. I mean, it's, yeah. it's just not. And I, and I don't mean that it's, um, you know, justifying hazing or anything like that. But like, if somebody messes up and, and it's bad enough, it's like, okay, well, you're going to grab some dirt bikes, like the two of you go grab dirt bikes. You're not allowed to turn them on and you're going to walk the flight line with them, you know, yeah. and you're going to what we call bang gates and you're going to have a ruck on. And it's not, I mean, that's, that's, it is, um, corrective, what is it, corrective training or whatever you want to, I don't know. I mean, it just, it, like in the pipeline, we get you so tired that you can't fake it anymore. That's if you true. push the bike around the pipeline, you're going to get to a point where you're too tired to lie to yourself. And you're going to be like, man, I really jacked up. Like you're gonna have conversations with yourself. Like you yeah. need that that you need that space where all we're telling you is like you need like a space and an environment where you can like actually think about this. Cause like I have a, a, a super robust, like arrogant ego type thing. And like it's easy to like if someone comes at me with a criticism, like my first reaction is like, Man, get effed. Like I'm perfect, blah blah blah, whatever. Like you get me smoked and you get me alone and you give me some time to think about it, and it's just like, you know, they're right. <laughs> like I, I definitely, I, I haven't been pushing as hard as I could be. I'm not doing the right stuff. Like by the time I get back, I'll, I'll be a better person for this. I, uh, I ran into a guy, I'll just use his first name, Corey, uh, here on Nellis. Uh, he was on the teams at, at the two, two. 
and uh, we ended up running and he's running with earbuds in and, and he says to me, he's like, Hey dude, what? Like you, you just run no music, no nothing. No, just it's like, yeah, just me and my, me and my thoughts. And yep. uh, that's a, that's a real thing when you're out there on your own and you're just sucking and you don't have something to distract you. All you have is like, that's my thinking time. Yep. And it's whether it's positive, negative, or you got to do better or, Ooh, I have this idea for the podcast or, or we, we should do this or, or whatever. Like running is when I think when I'm alone in my own thoughts. Yep. That is a yep. real thing. There's, there's something about it or something about breaking yourself down, like, and, 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 and reassessing. And I think that that habit starts that that is the selection course. Right. And we're constantly, you know, every day is a selection and we do it to ourselves as well. And those are the guys that, that, that make it, that's that independence and that self-regulation is, is, you know, it, it's hard to lie to yourself when, you know, you're barely making it, you know, or you're smoked or you're alone. You, you know, you, you gotta, and, and maybe that's just something you develop over time, but you got, you got to learn how to be honest and, and, to, and to fix yourself. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, cause you're not going to be listening to music in the pipeline. You no. might be singing Jody's, but yeah, <laughs> you're probably going to be singing. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's, it's weird. The pipeline is a lot different now because it's like, I think they, they definitely still do Jody's, 